Welcome back, crew! It's 56k here, the Dial of Desperado, and we are about ready to jump right back into the one dupe challenge with Ruby. And also, guys, I would like to thank all of you that come and watch the videos. We have now hit 100 subscribers. Thank you so much for all the support. I greatly appreciate it. If you wouldn't mind, please subscribe if you're new and also give the video a thumbs up. We greatly appreciate that as well. All right, let's jump right into this. All right, so we have made a few little uh, changes while you were gone. I did some researching, did some digging and stuff, kind of the, some boring stuff. But as you see, we are now got a ranch going up here. All right, and we have one, we got one little slug egg right there. And that's the only slug egg we got. We have no more. We're trying to keep track of that. We got a couple other plans going on. We are gathering a ton, a ton of hydrogen. So from all the plug slugs, just, you know, doing their business. So that's from there. So the plan is to try to um, harness this free power up here. I don't think it will last long, but it's free power that we can start pumping in and using for some other things, just in case the plug slugs fail. All right, let's check the pretty pot here. Yeah, we can't take anybody except for the seeds. So for those of you who are new, we are playing Oxygen Not Included with one dupe and one dupe only. There he is, the man, the myth, the legend, Ruby right there. He has been going strong, doing all the work himself. We're trying really hard to get some of this figured out. So that's what we're trying to do. We're going to jump up here and we want to get some nines going up here. We want him to get that done first before this stuff. I don't understand why he's there he goes all right he's on his way up get some more yeah i know that irritates your eyes up there all that hydrogen and it's hard to breathe but you're doing a great job ruby let's keep it up buddy so we're gonna get that we're gonna get that up there we're gonna get some um pipes and some vents and stuff just to Pipe down some hydrogen and get some um, clean or some uh, power up there. Okay. So that is the plan. So I think what we're going to do, let's check. Oh, we don't have it. That's more researching to bottle all this stuff up. Hmm. Hmm. So let's come in here. We're going to dig this out and we're going to dig this here and all of that there. We're even going to come up one more up here too. And he can't get over there because we've got to put some ladders. One ladder right there. Get that done. The other thing that we are sort of somewhat working on down here, we're trying to get a spawn up and running as well. Just, just to eventually have to help with some of this air here, you know, oxygen. I mean, we got plenty of oxygen. We're getting a little carbon dioxide here and there. Um, not terrible. But uh, we're, we're going to have to eventually deal with that as well. Um, so, yeah. I don't know if we're going to use a carbon skimmer and skim this eventually. But it would be nice to get some air pumping here. So that we don't have to rely on anything else. We're not really relying on anything right now. We're relying on whatever was here from the get-go. And we still have... A good amount of air, but I like to get some more air in here. So up here, I would like to put the to put that right there, and we're going to connect that to a smart battery, and we're also going to use a power transformer. Okay, I don't know exactly what we're going to power with this, but we're going to power something. I really wish we had some researching, and I really wish we had the Ventilation. Oh, it's down here. Ventilation gases. Uh, where are? Oh, it's here. And the gas reservoir would really help to do this. You know, to deal with this. But you know what? Maybe we do this. Um. Maybe we dig this out over here too.
and uh, yeah, I kind of want to put that on hold for a minute because this isn't gonna unless we're really powering something. You know what? Maybe we can have it power the um, incubators. Maybe that's what we do. We have a power of these incubators, so it is, you know, using some power. I have to get some nines up here, please. All that can wait. That's no rush. We also need to get a gas pump, and we want us to get way up here at the top, because hydrogen's going to move all the way to the top, and then we want to make this come down. The other thing we want to do with this is this let's see what do we got igneous rocks okay so let's do this igneous rock we're gonna put igneous rock here on the floor and we'll use this to also power this as well so we're gonna do a couple things here so we're gonna get some power going that might be unreachable but we'll see and we're also going to take the power down. Huh. I really would like to. We'll go right like that. Oh, I know, Ruby, your eyes are bothering you so much. I'm so sorry, my man. Put some heavy watt wire here, here, and here. And a lot we don't, how do we not have automation wire, but we have other things. Okay, well, we're gonna have to wait on that automation wire because that's some more researching to do. And I don't wanna do that on camera because that's boring. Who wants to see that? And let's check our skills. Oh, we, oh. So look at this, this is great because now Ruby's gonna be able to ranch, okay? With that ranching ability, we're gonna be able to take these random plug slugs that are just floating around here. Now, all of them are chomping on wires except for this guy, and we can put them in here. So we can do that too. So it's about, we can put some wire here and we can make this wire come down and join into the rest of this power down here. So we'll just run this all the way down. So it just ties back into this power source. And we also need to make sure that these plug slugs get food because they get a little crabby if they don't get food. So we're gonna give them some food. I wish they ate other stuff besides metal. Like I think that's kind of obnoxious that they gotta eat metal. I mean, they eat all, look at all this metal they eat. And excrete hydrogen which all in all not a bad thing because we can maybe just get more power from that as well but all right ruby you got some work to do man you got you got i need you to do this 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 and get all this done power needs to come down here down here here and there as well okay we have no plug slug eggs, which is just kind of heartbreaking. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, please comment on the video. Please like if you're still enjoying everything. If you have comments or you would like to see Ruby do something, let me know. Um, also, guys, make sure that you tune into my other Oxygen Not Included videos as well. We have the... Um, uh, we have the like oxygen through event soap opera and they are 30 second like 30 seconds to a minute skits of uh, from oxygen not included a lot of drama has been happening in the last couple episodes if you haven't tuned in that check out the playlist on the video Also, what other games would you guys like me to play? If you have suggestions, please let me know in the comments. I'm always up to hearing what other games you guys would like to, or games you are currently watching on YouTube, what games are you watching on Twitch, or any of those other platforms. Please let me know. I've been thinking about starting a new series. Not like I can keep up with the, all the other ones, but uh, you know, 
kind of mix it up and gives you something else to watch, but let me know what you do like. We'd love to hear from you. I, I'm, I'm just going to be completely honest with you guys. I thought this would go a lot worse than it is going. It's going fairly well. I mean, I think it helps that we have the plug slugs, to be completely honest, because they are just powering up everything. Now that we gave these people some more space to crawl around, that has helped tremendously. Um, you know, we got this guy trapped in here. We got this guy over here. This guy's not doing anything. Um, but it has helped tremendously with the plug slugs. I mean, I don't think I could do this normally i think we would have to i think we'd be really struggling to get power i mean we would have to rely on coal and always filling up the coal and everything else right now we we are not filling up any power so we can use all our time for building and digging and everything else we do need to i mean ruby is in a you know he is not stressed at all he has no disease i mean he's got great health i mean morale is 13 out of 9 so i mean he's feeling pretty good everybody so you know we'll see how we can go now i think eventually we're gonna get to these um you know we're gonna get to this guy here and um i don't know where the other one's at right now because we haven't explored much and keeping it kind of in here we got oh we got the one down here and the one up here so eventually we're going to get to, you know, we got space up here and we are eventually going to get to the, the teleporter. So I don't know how that's going to work. I mean, do we, do we eventually teleport Ruby to the other planet to wake up the new person if there is one? Or do we, you know, have to send them in a rocket? Let me know what you think. What is your thoughts? We're gonna take the copper. We're gonna put it in this feeder here eventually. We have no farm yet. I think that's what these are gonna be farms over here. A little chilly for farms. We might put some farms up here too because we can grow. Um... No, this guy's stuck. We should dig him out so that he's not stuck in there. We'll make this a nine too so that he gets dug out because that poor guy is stuck up there. Um, oh, these things, uh, the, the grub fruit. So, you know, we can grow some grub fruits up here with the good old grub grub and he's chilling. So maybe we can eventually get some grub grubs up here. We definitely need to still insulate the base too. Um, oops, not that one. It's a little warm here, down here, but it, the base is overall pretty cold. So we'll see how and what we can do. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we fast forward a little bit and did some researching and stuff. We did get all of this built up here. It's fantastic. And we got um, some incubating going. We have no eggs selected right now because there's nothing to select. We still got some great fish going down here. That's good. We got some fillets we need to get. So really when it comes down to it, next thing we need to get is this built. We're going to start working on this, getting some fresh air pumped in here. We got enough water to do it. We, can't, we eventually need to get in here and start digging this out dealing with this water and this water would be fantastic uh, we will get there um, the other thing I think we need to do is eventually work on trying to get shipping I think that would really help especially with these this fish thing going on down here if we could get um, you know some of the stuff picked up and just dumped instead of him going down there and doing all this and you know speaking of that let's I, I would really like if we could just kind of dig some of this out still somehow some way you know just just remove this stuff as possible as best we can would help just make the water level go down and it's a little bit easier to get than things guys uh, i'm glad you're sticking with me thanks for being here again thank you so much for the 100 subscribers it means a lot please comment if you like the videos please like them 
All right. Let's me know what you, if you're still into them or not. Um, we will see you next time. We've got a little bit of stress going on. We'll see you next time. We're going to come back and get this built. Oh, let's see what we get this time. Ooh, copper or copper ore? Hmm, interesting. I, I kind of just want to take the copper, not the copper. Not the co I'm going to take the copper ore, not the copper, because I might use this for building certain things. We we can always smash this up. Oh, gosh, we're going to take the copper. All right, guys, thanks again. You guys have been wonderful, and we'll see you soon, all right?